we're standing in Kathmandu, and um, what you see around us are people that live in these homes are trying to get to their belongings. They're uh, knocking over walls so that they can get to the part of their uh, apartments. And um, the destruction of these pockets is just incredible. Behind, uh, the, behind you, David, you can see live wires that are just hanging here that were taken down because of the earthquake. Um, it's really as far as the eye can see how, how terrible the destruction was. About two-thirds of this country were impacted, about eight million individuals, and they need shelter, they need water, they need sanitation. Um, the, the list is pretty much endless. A number of schools were taken out. Thankfully, children weren't impacted because it was holiday, but the schools need to be rebuilt. Hospitals came down. We saw a makeshift hospital where people were just lying in beds uh, outside um, in the heat. So the, the need is absolutely enormous. We have been working with the Nepal Red Cross very closely to make sure that they're prepared in the event of a big disaster. And as we've been touring the countryside and right here in Kathmandu, um, we see all kinds of signs that that training has taken place. We see Red Cross insignia. We see youth volunteers who've been trained on evacuation techniques. The kids here are really prepared. Um, they have a junior Red Cross, and the, the kids know what to do in the event of an earthquake, what to do at, in terms of an evacuation plan. And they did these things. And now that their schools have collapsed, we saw 450 kids that were youth volunteers that have helped stand up a makeshift hospital, um, all because of the training that they received to be prepared. And the American public has been so generous. We are so grateful for every single donation. And anyone that's interested in helping could go on redcross.org. Uh, we also have volunteer opportunities to do mapping from the U.S. to help people get a better landscape and a better picture of what's going on here in Nepal.